guys. So today I have another Timu haul and today it's a little bit late coming out. Um, I had a really busy weekend. Um, you heard my Saturday plans. Yesterday was my husband's birthday. So we were out and about and then doing things at home together as a family the entire day. Um, and my husband and I were up like till 10 o'clock watching shows after dinner and all that stuff. So jam packed. Then I was going to film this morning after I got Royce on the bus, but, um, uh, my husband and I went to Shady Maple. We just got back. Um, we went to breakfast for his birthday because yesterday they're not open on Sundays. So they honor, um, birthdays on an off day the following day. So, um, they do like, um, you get a free meal there and then a bunch of coupons. So then after that, we went to a couple of the stores that they own and stuff like that. So I just got home filming now, then editing. So that's why it's a little late today. But anyways, back to this haul. As always, if you're interested in purchasing any of the items that you see in this video, all of the links will be provided in the description box down below, as well as if you have not signed up for Timu yet and you would like to, there's a link that you can click on, sign up and get a hundred dollar coupon bundle. So as always, going to dump the bag and then start showing you things. Okay. So this first thing. This was 68 cents. I got this actually for my neighbor. We have become pretty good friends. And actually on Saturday, we hung out the entire day. Well, the entire evening and night. We stayed there till like 1030, almost 11 o'clock. And uh, I had made her a Coraline cup for, for her and she loved it and um when she posted it on her facebook page uh she gave a little backstory with it and it was like a really touching story and i saw this this is a dtf transfer iron-on transfer i saw this on timu and it was 68 cents and i was like i have to get this so i'm going to make her a shirt or hoodie i think i i think this would actually what do you guys think a t-shirt or would this look really good on a hoodie i think this would look amazing like even on a black hoodie like this i think i'm gonna do a hoodie with this and i'm gonna or a crew neck crew neck i think i'm gonna do that yes for christmas and I'm going to surprise her with it. And we have never done gift exchange before, but I just thought that would be a really nice gesture. And, um, she did host our little get together. So it'd be a nice thank you for that as well. But I, I just found it on Timu and I was like, I really want to do that for her. So yeah, I have that. Then some of these little things. Okay. So these two, I read wrong. I thought it was 10 and 20 keychains. It was 10 and 20 pieces, which it's got the keychain and then a, um, an extra jump ring. So it was 10 junk jump rings, 10 keychains, five and five for this one. So, um, this was 96 cents and I mean, I'm not going to complain. I was going to, um, I was going to send a refund thing and be like, Hey, you false advertised. But then when I went back and actually looked at it, I was like, Oh, that was my bad. I didn't read. <laughs> I get excited about things sometimes and I don't read closely and I just put it right into my cart. And sometimes I don't look at the um, reviews like I should because I get excited when I see it. And I was like, oh my gosh, I want that. And then it turned out not in my favor. 
every once in a while. But yeah, 96 cents for 20 pieces. So here is the keychain ring. And then it's got, it's even got like a swivel one. So like for 96 cents, even for 10, these are like nice quality keychain rings. And then um, up here, it opens like this to put like your keys on and stuff like that. And then it comes with one of these open jump rings. So 10 of those, 10 of these. And then the second bag that I got is the same thing, but it's five and five for 63 cents. And instead of silver, it's in gold. And then it opens right there. And then it comes with those open jump rings as well. So kind of bummed that I'm not getting 30, 30 keychains all together, but 25 is or 15 is fine. And I mean, they're under a dollar a piece, so I can just go back and buy sets when I need them. Then this was 29 cents for a pack of 10. And these are just little charms for keychains. And I thought they were really cute. So they're silver hearts with a clear rhinestone in the middle. Now, this came in several different colors, but I chose clear because they're very versatile and I can use them for any keychain that I have and I don't have to color match except for the hardware. But if I feel like grabbing more, I mean, for 29 cents, I could probably get them in several other colors as well, but I chose clear just because I wanted to see how they came and what they looked like and all that before I ordered a whole bunch. This was 84 cents and I have some of these that I got from the $1 zone, but mine are a tad bit bigger, but I'm running low on certain colors. So I wanted to um, get more and I decided why not on Timu? They're probably cheaper. They're, you know, I don't have to leave my house to get them, but they're just these really pretty iridescent beads. And you can't really see the iridescence on camera that well. Oh, there we go. Can you see that? But they're just multicolored, a whole bunch of colors. There's blues, there's pinks, there's reds, there's clears, purples, just really pretty. And I believe there is a hundred and I can't get them back in the bag. It doesn't say, but there's either 50 or a hundred, but that looks more like a hundred and they're eight millimeters. So these are for my beaded pens. I'm gonna try to like stand them up over there so they don't fall all over the place as I'm showing you everything else. This was 69 cents. And of course I can't get that bag open. That was a task. <laughs> and these are just silver. I'm not gonna open them because they, they don't reseal, but they're just silver little flat beads. These are spacer beads. Now I have a whole bunch of spacer beads that are rhinestone studded around the outside, but these are just smooth and they're just silver. So these are nice to have for the beaded pens if I need to add a little extra, you know, so that the stuff's not spinning around and around and around and loose. These add a little extra room so that, um, and they look cute in between. And if I don't, you know, if the rhinestones don't really go with the theme of the pen, I can just put in these plain ones. Then, okay, let's see. We're going to keep going on beads and crafting. So then I got these beads for 78 cents. Does not say how many are in there, but I believe there's 50, either 50 or 30. That looks like more like 50. These are glow in the dark. 
and I believe they're eight millimeters as well. They're just plastic glow in the dark beads. So I thought these would be nice. Um, obviously Halloween's over, but it would have been nice for Halloween pens, but it'd be nice for like any pens to add like a little glow to. Then these were 86 cents for, I think there's 10, but it looks more like 15. There's 20. Okay. So I got 20 of these and I have some of these, but I think there's a dip. I think they are stars actually, but like how pretty are they? They're like little globes. They're almost like a Christmas ball. They're clear little globe things. And then they have star iridescent star sequence in them. And there's, I got the random pack. So one of them is multicolored. I have one orange. I have one light blue, one gold, one yellow, two dark blue, two, they're like almost like a teal. And of course, I'm running out of space in my hand. <laughs> I have three light green, two light pink, a purple, and this is like a lavender purple, a really light orange, almost peach, two hot pink, and two magenta. And I love these. These are really nice. I've put these on several keychains before. Then I got this for 33 cents. And this actually, let me show you what it was supposed to be. Okay. So this showed up like this in the picture, like when you went to buy it and stuff. Um, this is what it looked like in my cart. This is what it looked like um, in my like bought like items where it lists the items and you can go to the link and it's a pencil. And I thought these are really nice for teacher gifts at the end of the year. So I'm gonna make like a whole bunch of these and make them for my kids' teachers and then maybe advertise if anyone wants me to make them for their kids' teachers. Um, and I was like, pencil, perfect. Put the name right here. Now, when I ordered it, I didn't realize when I clicked on it, it said crayon. So here's the picture, what it looks like the crayon and I was like, well, that's cute too. So then in my next order that's coming, I don't know if it's the next order or the order after that, um, I have a pencil. So now I have two, which not a big deal. If I end up getting a lot of orders for these, now I have two, but I was like, <laughs> I thought I was gonna have a crayon and a pencil because crayons are cute for, you know, preschool kindergarten teachers pencils are are nice for you know older grade teachers but that's fine let me show you it up close but that's definitely a pencil but nonetheless really cute now I'll have two no big deal and the other one was just as cheap if not cheaper all right next up I have three bracelets. So this first one was 83 cents. These are for Brooklyn. She loves beaded bracelets. So I got her a few of them. We have Karomi and these beads are really cute. They're clear on the outside and then they have a color in the middle and then some little silver beads. But I thought this was really, really pretty. She loves pink. She would have loved purple too, but I think the pink is really cute. Then the second one is really gorgeous too. This was 51 cents. And it's Hello Kitty. And it's got a studded 
Hello Kitty charm. It's got um, a little, two little bells on it. They look like bells. Oh, this one's a heart. This one's a bell, but this bell. Oh, it does have something in it, but you can barely hear it. <laughs> and then it's got these like um, frosted beads all around it, which are really, really pretty. But I just thought this was adorable and that she'd love this. Let me show you that way. Then the last one was 44 cents and it is a really pretty cat bracelet and this has really interesting beads on it so in the middle it's got a cat charm but then look at some of these there's wooden beads here this like stone bead the same um colors this is a stone bead too but it's in the shape of a star um these really pretty like calico looking beads look at that one that's like a shell but I just thought that the this was so adorable, so gorgeous, and she's going to love all of these bracelets. She's a big bracelet wearing. She's big into bracelet wearing. Then I got some socks for advent calendars. So these three are all for Brody. For his advent, he loves the character socks. So I got him Pennywise. These were 79 cents. I got Peter Griffin. He loves Family Guy. These were 59 cents. He already has Stewie ones. So I was like, hey, why not get some Peter ones? And he's beat up in this. I just realized I think this is where he fought that big chicken. If you've watched Family Guy. And then the last one. He has a pair of Chucky socks. But this is a different. Um, this is a. Different looking pair. Than the other one that I got him. So I got him Chucky. And these were. 88 cents. Then I got the two younger kids some gloves because they love playing out in the snow and every year they have socks on their hands because they lost their gloves so i got them gloves early this year these are not going for christmas these are i'm giving to them right when snow starts in really cold weather so these were a dollar 26 these are for royce and these have the grippies on them but these are a small child size pair of gloves for him. And then Brooklyn, I paid $1.27 for hers. So they were like the same price, minus one cent. And these are even texting gloves. So this part you can use like to still use your phone while you're wearing your gloves. But these I got for her in black. Then these I just saw, they were hiding under something. These go with my keychains and stuff. So this was 84 cents. And this is a pack of 10. And they are the little pom-pom things, but they're cheetah prints. How cute are those? So I got a whole pack of cheetah print ones. And they have little like um, shiny like iridescent little hairs on them. To make them like sparkle a little bit this i got for brooklyn this was 43 cents so this is a hair scrunchie she was asking for some scrunchies and stuff but i thought this was really neat let's see if i can oh do you have to open it is there a way to open it excuse my dog he is barking and my husband is in there and has not let him in yet so there's a thing that you pull out. I kind of want to wait to do that till she uh, opens it for Christmas, but um, it lights up. <laughs> it like, yeah, there's a light in there. So I thought that was really cute. And I can even show you 
what it looks like. There's all different colors. I got the pink. Then this I got for Royce. This was $3.33. And then it price adjusted to under $2. So I was super excited about that. Because plushies can get really expensive on Timu sometimes. Ooh, there's a little hole starting there. I'm going to have to have my husband uh, sew that. Ooh, like that is coming undone. I'm definitely going to have to have him sew that before I give it to him for Christmas. But this is a noob plushie from Roblox. I didn't know what a noob was until... Until he kept saying it and being like, noob, noob. I'm like, what's a noob? And then he showed me and I was like, oh. And then I saw it on Timu and I was like, oh my gosh, he'll love that. So this is a little noob from Roblox. My voice is obsessed with Roblox. So yeah, he's going to be excited to get that for Christmas. And then last up, I got this for my husband. This is a set of three. It was $3.17. And they are socks, but they are hunting socks. So these ones have deer on them and a dog and some weapons. And then on the bottom, it says, sorry, I can't. <gasps> they sent me two of the same socks. Oh, I'm going to have to get a refund on these too. Uh, it's supposed to say, sorry, I can't. And then the other one was supposed to say, I'm hunting. Oh, no, I'm so upset. Oh, well, that pair is a bust. I mean, he can still wear them, but it's still not as funny as the socks are supposed to be. Let's see if they messed up the second one. The second one has like mounted deer heads and some guns. And at the top, it says the best hunter. And on the bottom, it says, um, let's see. There is always time. Now this one is right for hunting. And then the third one has a whole bunch of animals on it and some weapons. Let's see. These are these are the correct ones too. This one says I'd rather be hunting. And I forget what the first one says, but I'll look it up and I'll put it here because, uh, I was, that one was actually the best one that I like. It described my husband like to the T, but, uh, yeah, kind of upset about that. I may see if maybe, um, they'll give me some money back for that one faulty one. And then maybe I can find like a singular one of that same sock and just buy that. But who knows? I don't know what I'm going to do. But anyways, that was everything for this video. And like I said in the beginning of the video, if you're interested in purchasing any of these items, all of the links will be in the description box down below, as well as if you have not signed up for Timu yet and you would like to, there's a link that you can click on, sign up, and get a $100 coupon bundle. But that is everything for today. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up, leave a comment, and if you haven't already, please subscribe. Thank you for watching and have an awesome day. Bye!